Raul Pancheco, a Cuban living in Miami, allegedly struck a deal with Union de España, a childhood friend of the famed outfielder. Pacheco offered Despaigne $150,000 and a house if he managed to convince Puig to defect to the United States. Despaigne, Puig and his girlfriend and a priest left their home in Cienfuegos in April 2012 and caught a ride to Playa Giron to meet their guide for the journey. But the group drove on as the agreed rendezvous point was swarming with police. When they finally met their guide in Playa Laga, the police were once again hot on their tails. The group then spent 30 hours trekking to a barrier island near the Bay of Pigs, where they would board a vessel hired by Raul Pancheco that would take them to Mexico. A cigarette boat picked them up. The trip was allegedly coordinated by Tomás Vález Valdivia, a gangster with links to the drug cartel Los Zetas. The boat delivered the group to the Mexican island of Isla Mujeres, but Pancheco did not have enough money to pay Valdivia, who then threatened to chop off Puig's arms with a machete forcing Pancheco to seek help from a fixer, the leader of another smuggling ring. The fixer arranged for a boat to take them to Cancun in return for a portion of Puig's future income. The defectors later boarded a flight to Mexico City. Puig then traveled to the border town of Reynosa, walked onto the international bridge linking the town to Hidalgo, Texas, and applied for asylum.